Hello everyone, welcome to BIM Modeler. This is Raj. In this video tutorial, we will be learning how to place an equipment. What are the equipments available mostly in the HVAC design systems? These are the uh, equipments like air filter, fans, AHUs, cooling towers, boilers, control systems like water chiller, humidifier, dehumidifier, VAV units. Based on the system classification that type we have discussed earlier, the equipments also vary. Let's discuss in our project. We need a heating pump in this place and in the rooftop we have the cooling towers on the rooftop in this place and we have the another equipment AHU it is a rooftop AHU which is available in this place we want to load first cooling tower and go to the component or system mechanical equipment load family we are talking about mechanical right so I'm using the US metric template so go to the folder mechanical we are not placing any architectural elements, we are placing MEP elements and the cooling tower which handles the water based equipment. So we have to go ahead and see inside the water side components because it mostly handles the water uh, in and out of the equipment. Let me check one by one. cooling tower I need a cooling tower uh, which is uh, 67 to 1 a 89 let me load this while placing the cooling tower we are in the level at zero level and we wanted to rotate this equipment as similar to any other families you can press the space Automatically, it will rotate based on your origin. Place the family. Use the align command. Align it in the proper position. To match with cat. Once it is done, you can click this element and use the section box option. Go to the next equipment. In a similar way now we have to load the mechanical equipment of AHU mechanical equipment this time I need to load a mechanical equipment from our folder which is mechanical equipment outdoor AHU unit horizontal load this family which is available in the hands-on file you can download it from bemolder.com load this family it's existing already over the existing version and try to load them from this place I am looking for a uh, 5.7 square meter coil and you will be able to use the space key to rotate them and placed on the rooftop zero level once it is placed go to the modified tab and use the align command align it in the proper position now you can go to the third mechanical level which is here and we have done already some routings if you see that the mechanical equipment is supposed to be placed here so to understand these equipments what equipments are placed we will be having a detailed uh, document which defines the uh, what are the equipments and their sizes and their manufacture all the detailed specifications will be with us uh, from the designer who designed the HVAC design but in this case uh, I will let you know that this is the equipment which is a heating pump which does the uh, option to uh, control the room uh, air temperature um, based on these equipment it will be changed from the cooling tower the uh, uh, refrigerant will be supplied to this equipment based on that uh, equipment the heating and cooling will be happening with this space now we have to load the mechanical equipment load family and this is an uh, water based component 
So we can go ahead and look for the library in Revit 2020 library and here's metric and looking for a mechanical equipment MEP equipment air side component heat pumps I'm looking for an uh, horizontal equipment and 7 to 18 within that there are four types available let me load all of those four types in this four i'm looking for left return right return left return right discharge so 18 kilowatts these all specification will be defined in our specification book from the designer so from that i'm pressing this one using spacebar and then i'm clicking in this place you can use the uh, uh, spacebar to rotate and change their value based on the value the sizes will be varying Align it in the right place, it will be fit. But do remember, we have placed this equipment, we are not sure that what height it placed. By default, it places on the level, zero level. Select the equipments that you want to compare with the ducts and use the section box and see them in the 3D. It, it got placed in the ground level. We know the duct height of these elements and we have to move them upside also. So let me keep this equipment at 3000 while connecting the duct, we may have to coordinate them and then we have to change their elevation height. Let me copy this element to the other places, select the equipment and finish it. Use the corner and place them in a multiple places use the multiple option one to the corner here i have placed it in three places similarly you have to do it on the other places also find useful functions and try to create the other types the matching types from these four types place them along the building all the sites and we will be discussing the remaining the next section thank you so much for watching see you on the next tutorial